All right, man. Uh, Megan Thee Stallion. Apparently, the doctor said that um, it was glass on her foot. We'll start there. Then we work our way to casting over two times. Rapper out of New York, uh, pleading guilty. All right. So thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe button. It's the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase chance of notifications. We go live or drop video now. Apparently, a doctor going around saying that. Uh, well, apparently they're saying it's a fake rumor. They're saying it's fake. So there you go. Um, so they saying it's fake. The doctor from the injury was from stepping on glass. So that's what they're saying is fake. Uh, let's read it. This is, here we go. So it says that the bunk fake rumor says stepping on glass caused making stallion for the injury. Um, it says in an uh, amendment on the initial police report from Tory Lane's Megan Stallion led shooting has resurfaced online. The report from two years ago when Megan initially thought she had stepped in glass, page six report. Um, the savage artist opened up about the incident. We all know that. So basically they saying it's it's fake. Hold on, man. So they saying it's fake. It says y'all want to be made to be liars. What's going around is an initial police report, not a medical report. It's been said that the sheep uh she told police she stepped on glass initially. That's not new. It wasn't until later the doctor confirmed and told her she had fragments, uh bullet fragments in her foot. I mean, at the end of the day, bro, you know, you don't know if you stepped on glass or got shot. And it continue to go on the end, end of the day. Um, if she had bullet fragments, you got bullets and ballistics and all that. Then why Tory Lanez ain't locked up? Why is it taking so long to convict Tory Lanez? Was Tory Lanez the one that shot? All right. Was it somebody else that shot her? I mean, you had witnesses out there too. This is a, it's a damn pool party. You know. And in that interview, she did sound like she was lying because I seen her talking about how she liked to get physical with her men and stuff. I can find that video, man. Like I said before, I don't get it. I don't get it. So, did you step on glass or not? So they saying that's from the initial police report. So, I mean. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. Um, but they saying it's, it's it's fake, but it's not fake. Long story short, it was from the initial police report, and they saying the doctor never said that. So you got Bob talking about it. So they found out it was fake and took it down. <laughs> All right, so it was a fake report. So man, at the end of the day, hopefully we can, you know, hopefully we can, you know, get past this. Hopefully they can close this case. It's been drawn out it's on two years ago. Ian Tory Lanez is a Canadian. So and he a Canadian, bro. Like he she. Man, he got, man, I forgot he got caught all that shit in South Florida, and he's still, you know, he's still walking around. Like, you supposed to be deported, you know, off some stuff like that, but you know how it go. You know how it go, but, um, but yeah, it's an old fake news, you know. So, I mean, first she wouldn't cooperate, now she cooperate, now she say Tori tried to pay her off. A while ago, she hopefully they just figured this out. There ain't no place for you shooting no woman. So he said, Dance, that shit was funny, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> it's not funny what he did, but them all dance talking about dance. I'm like, Man, chill, but yeah, man, it's the first time he got in trouble, neither. And he already violated a restraining order and all, all types of stuff. so then she lied and said they wasn't sexual. That that was a big, big lie. Tomorrow, no, we 
We were not sexual. We, man, please. That right there, give her an over. You lie, you lie over a little. Even, even Gail had to say, like, come on, no more. Come on, Mag. So you never had no, we, we were just like friends. If you gotta lie about something as silly, if you gotta lie about something as silly as you know, kicking it with somebody, then you know, what else you gonna lie about? What else you gonna lie about? But it is what it is. Let's move on. Rapper Casanova. Uh, pleads guilty to racketeering conspiracy drug charge. I never even remember hearing. I heard one song by him, and that's because I was at the Barclay Centers. I don't even know his music, but he seemed cool. Remember, he picked up that homeless dude and, you know, cleaned him up, gave him a meal, put some clothes on him. So, I mean, you know, one thing I remember, they was during the COVID pandemic, and he was shooting a video. He was like, man. Maybe I'm sorry, they can't, uh, 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 they can't tell us what to do, <laughs> you know, but it says the highly tipped MC was indicted in, in a sprawling drug conspiracy case in 2020 and now faces up to 60 years in prison. I think the minimum is five, unless he work out a deal, but um, they targeting rappers, been targeting rappers, and I got to agree with T.I.'s other organizational groups. That's far more threatening than rappers that they targeted, that they should be targeted. You know, you guys, they just tried to, you know, take some public officials, mayors and stuff, and governors and stuff, and they tried to take them, and all of them got off. State capital, all of them got off. You know, it's definitely a, 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 a <clears throat> double standard. But the rappers make it so easy. All I got to do is listen to their IG and listen to their music. You know, it says 2019 Casanova Star was on the rise. The rapper, whose real name was Caswell Sr., hell of a name, played a title sponsor festival, festival at the Barclay Centers and energized the venue, as Rolling Stone noted. In a way, only a hometown Brooklyn, Brooklyn hero can. Sr. also seemed ready to tackle his demons head on. In his new album at the time, Behind the Stars, Sr. learned into, uh, leaned into his vulnerability, departing from an unflinching style that made him a rising star. Okay, we don't need to know that. But Senior had also confronted the criminal justice system. His his work and his advocacy of be, uh, behind the scars, track jail calls. Senior described being suicidal behind bars. Quote, I've been in the belly of the beast thinking of suicide. I've been hearing uh, my mother cry on the phone. Just why? Why again? You can't explain it. Senior told Rolling Stone 2019. She don't understand. I had to, I had to rob. That's me. That's my life story. That's the scars. He even spoke about prison reform at Harvard University. He says, um, senior ascent didn't last, uh, didn't last on October 1st, 2020. The federal prosecutors revealed that Casanova was one of 18 alleged untouchable Gorilla Stone Nation gang members and died in a sprawling drug conspiracy case. Conspiracy. That means they don't mean they could I mean, don't even mean that they know they, they don't they don't need no conspiracy change, everything. The conspiracy ran from 2004 to 2020 in New York City and upstate. Prosecutors alleged in court documents, prosecutors also claimed that Senior Casanova closely co uh, coordinated his artistic endeavors to benefit the gang, sharing some of his money with the Gorilla Stones founder, the White Reed, who was serving 50 to life uh, prison sentence for a 2014 murder. And on Wednesday, Senior pled guilty in White Plains Federal Court, two counts of racketeering conspiracy and narcotics conspiracy. Senior sporting a navy blue jail scrubs and pumpkin orange undershirt waved to his family and blew them kisses when he walked into the courtroom at 11.20 a.m., 25 a.m. The proceedings took a grim turn quickly when Judge Phillips M. Uh, Helper stated that, uh, started asking questions characteristic of all guilty plea proceedings. Among them was senior under the care of a doctor or psychologist. Quote, they put me on suicide watch a couple days ago, senior said, a matter of factly, matter of factly. He described it as holding cell where you wear a smock and stuff. Senior said that he was not on any medication. Quote, are you comfortable comfortable today? The judge asked. He said, very comfortable, Your Honor. Senior replied, have you ever been hospitalized for mental health or substance abuse issues? In my teenage days, I attempted to kill myself a couple of times. Senior said, explaining that he had previously been sent to Bellevue Hospital in Manhattan. As a result of hospitalization, did you receive treatment? The judge asked, yes, I did. And your mind's clear today. He's uh Mr. Senior. He said, Yes, Your Honor. 
Watch your honor. You see that look here, man. Let me say this. It's not no no jab at him, but that 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 mental health thing don't work for black people. It don't work for us. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, it's it's just it's a shame, bro. We just really need our our own area, which you know, then y'all tear that up too. So I don't know about that. Singer said that he pled guilty to volunteering. Nobody was forcing him to cop to these crimes. Singer uh, knew there wasn't any guarantee that the plea would lessen his sentence. He said. So there you go. So, you know, I mean, there's a lot of stuff in here. I mean, talking about 100 kilograms. Uh, There's just a lot of stuff in here, man. It says with the plea deal, prosecutors would recommend a sentence range between 15 and 20 years in prison. Damn. With a mandatory minimum of five. He couldn't even get the minimum. His This joint is over. It's over. He couldn't even get the minimum. You know, he probably ready to start snitching. He probably wish he would have snitched now, but then they would have killed him regardless. So, he, you know, that's what you do when you join the game. If the mandatory file, however, senior could face far more time behind bar judge and federal court system. Don't have to follow sentencing re- recommendations and plea deals. Under the law, senior technically faces a maximum sentence of 60 years. Imprisonment he is set for sentencing December 6th. So, damn, he got to sit in there, damn near to. December 6th, so he had time served. Yeah, he had almost three years served with two, one on three. So I would have fled, bro. Real talk, they would have they had to do that. What, what Plan said, he said, if y'all want me, y'all gonna have to do your job, and that's real. They would have to come get me, bro. I'd have fled. I'd have went back to uh, where you from? He from like, he got Panama roots. They would have to come get me, bro. I've been, I've been with it. I mean, that's why you always keep cash on him. Always. They would have to come get me, bro. They would have to, they would have to come. I would have drove all the way or attempted to drive all the way somewhere. He ain't that famous. I'd have made it back to Panama and I'd have been just sitting there like y'all, you know. Is we'll go somewhere they don't extradite. You know, that's that's just what I did. But you know, it is what it is. You know. It's one thing you people don't think about when you, you know, when you join gangs and all that type of stuff, bro. Um, you know, it's forever. You know, a lot of times you can't get out of a gang. In rare cases, some people can, especially when you start becoming, you start making money. You know, it's a RICO charge. You ain't have to do nothing, but you just was there. So it is what it is. Thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, subscribe button, it's the bell icon button. Hit all notifications, increase chance of notifications. You know, live or drop a video. In addition to that, too, man, you got to remember, too, you can't snitch. Now, no boy, rainbow head can snitch. They ain't going to touch nobody that's not black. Think about that, not least right now. So, when you're a brother, man, they gonna, you know they're going to whack you. So, check out the music and tell me plays more videos like this. You want to financially, uh, Support the channel, cash up, dollar sign, CJ Good 313, Venmo, CJ Good 313, um, Venmo, uh, PayPal link in the description. You can check my link tree out, first link in the description, Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, Facebook. Now, Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, Spotify, Anchor, cash up, Venmo, PayPal there. It's the first link in the description. Appreciate the love.